Welcome back to our channel. We'd like to give you an update on our cooling system. In Alaska, we could not get a 12 volt cooler mailed up there. Amazon wouldn't send it, nobody would ship it up there. So we came down to Seattle and we just got ourselves a regular cooler and just kept ice every day. And it kind of be a pain. So we finally ordered this and we got it delivered and we picked it up to a place here in, uh, actually in Maryland where we're at now. And I'd just like to go over a few things. Uh, this is the 12 volt and it runs off of our battery pack. All right, remember our battery pack? We purchased that at REI. Now that can run 120 or 12 volt. We have it set up on 12 volt. And we've used this a couple of days. This can freeze or it can be a regular refrigerator. We have it set up as a refrigerator. So we're running about 42 degrees. And so the, the battery pack is pushing 12 volts. And the battery pack we have set up on our two 100 amp solar panels and the solar panels are keeping this charge up 100%. So last night we kept this plugged in and it only used like 10% off of the battery pack and the battery is getting charged up again with solar. So it's a really good setup. We would recommend it, uh, especially not having to work with ice. It, it just gets to be a pain having to drain it, put more ice in. And it makes Fifi happy too because we can keep her food cold. Right, Fifi? Yeah. You want to show everybody what it looks like? Okay. So this one is the 34 winter and it's got plenty of room in here. So you got your small one here with the compressors underneath that one. And then we have this bigger basket, which we've got really deep here. So we've got a lot of cool things in here. Got our vegetables, you can keep your pop, your, your water, whatnot. It's got two cooling areas for the compressor. So you want to make sure you don't cover those up. And this is the right size for this vehicle. So we can continue our adventures. Also, one other thing we did is for the front window and the rear window, we purchased uh, covers, and they're like the uh, like the foil cover ones. So we'll show you how those work. Those are really nice. So we'll, well, let's go to that next. Look at this. It's in nice. Yeah. Set at 42 degrees and holding. These okay. are lock-in suction cups. When you're in there, you put this down first. Got a hole there. This one in. Yeah. Okay, so this one comes with three suction cups, and we purchased this uh, through Amazon, and they came out of Maryland. And these are the suction cups you just push on and you turn, and they lock. So with this one, just to show you how we do it, we've got those suction cups put up there. Stick that up there like so. Pop one in there, pop one in there, pop one in on that side. And so we can not only keep it cool when it's hot out, but basically these are for when we're sleeping at night. So we don't have to put up um, a, like a curtain, which really doesn't, you know, give you any really good protections of people looking in. So we'll hold it there, pop that off, and then we'll turn that where it locks it. Okay, now that's on pretty good. Okay, that holds really good. I'm very happy with those. Let's go to the front. That's a really nice one too. So after driving a long day, the car kind of gets warm on the outside and that kind of pushes in on the inside. We do have our fan that runs for up to 24 hours, but we found out that you kind of need to open the windows to get a little bit of cool air that's at night. And you don't want to do that because the bugs come in. So we purchased these screens. You can get these on Amazon. And we'll put her on here. So that goes on the outside. Stretch it down like that. Put your windows down in the evening. And you people can't really see that the windows are down. And you'll get some airflow in there. And with your fan on, it does cool down very nicely. If you like any of the items that we showed you today, check the links below. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you next time here on The Joy of Life.